Hi, I'm Sarah. Welcome to The Daily English Show. Today we're studying a scene from the movie Jerry Maguire. I don't have this DVD, but I found the clip on Crackle. I just discovered the other day that they have a whole lot of clips from movies, which is great if you want to study English from movies. I watched this movie a while ago, so I can't really remember it very well, but it's something about an agent for sports stars, and it's pretty funny. This scene is a phone conversation between the agent and the athlete. He's a football player. The agent asks the athlete how he's doing and he replies, How am I doing? I'll tell you how I'm doing. I'm sweating, dude. I'm sweating my contract. And he goes on like that about sweating. This meaning of the word sweat is used in North America. It's not used in New Zealand and I'm not sure about other countries. It means worry about. So, I'm sweating dude, I'm sweating my contract means I'm worried dude, I'm worried about my contract. The agent tries to reassure him that everything's okay. He says, I hear what you're saying. But then Rod, the athlete, says, No, 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 I hear that you hear what I'm saying, but do you truly hear what I'm saying? It's pretty funny because people do use phrases like, I hear what you're saying and I know what you mean, when they're not really listening to what you're saying and they don't know what you mean. Kia ora, this is Stick News. The Fijian government has kicked the New Zealand High Commissioner out of the country and the New Zealand government has responded by sending the Fijian High Commissioner home. According to the New Zealand Herald, last week the Prime Minister of Fiji threatened to expel the New Zealand High Commissioner if a student visa was not granted to the son of a senior official in the President's office. The visa wasn't granted, so the High Commissioner was kicked out. New Zealand then announced Fiji's High Commissioner would be sent home. And that was Stick News for Tuesday the 23rd of December. Kia ora. On Saturday night, Samurai Bar opened. Samurai Bar is inside a yurt. In the bar there is a fire and, of course, a samurai. His name is Sam. Today's word is person. I'm sure you know what a person is, but do you know what the idiom in person means? In today's conversation, the agent says, Maybe the best thing is that we get together in person. If you do something in person, you go somewhere and do it yourself, instead of doing it by letter, asking somebody else to do it, etc. Rod? Rod, Rod, Jerry Maguire, how you doing? Listen, I hear what you're saying and that's why I'm calling. Hey, maybe uh, the best thing is that we get together in person. Rod, I'm sorry, would you mind holding? I've just got someone... Jerry Maguire, how am I doing? I'll tell you how I'm doing. I'm sweating, dude. I'm sweating my contract. I'm sweating Bob Sugar calling me, telling me I'm missing the big endorsements by being with you. That's how I'm doing. I'm sweating. You hear what I'm saying? No, no, no. I hear that you hear what I'm saying, but do you truly hear what I'm saying? Hold on. Didn't you tell my wife more personal attention? Did you not tell my wife more personal attention? To force somebody to leave a country. A. Expel. B. Grant. C. Kick out. D. Sweat. E. 
threaten. Expel. To say that you will cause trouble, hurt somebody, etc. if you do not get what you want. Threaten. Give a right, property, etc. formally or legally. Grant. To make somebody leave or go away. Kick out. Worry about. Sweat. And that was the Daily English Show. See you tomorrow. Bye.